Just kidding. Um, it's gonna be a painting video. Uh, maybe I should make it is no, no. I mean, it's just gonna be a normal painting video because I'm not gonna be holding this while I'm painting. But yeah. Uh, so tomorrow is my last exam and last school day for this year. So I'm big stressed. So I gotta like relieve it somehow and I decided to do that in the form of painting and I'm not gonna finish it tonight because it's like I don't know what time it is but it's late and I need a shower and I need to go to sleep but I'll probably finish it tomorrow after I leave school I have this it's a six by six canvas from Walmart it's already pre-primed um so let's just just repeal Okay. <laughs> Put in a little ASMR for y'all who are also stressed like me. Um. Uh. Okay, so right now I'm going to go in with a base color. I'm going to pick cream. the base uh, I'm gonna set it out to dry and then I have a tip for y'all that I like to use I'm not a very like good painter but I just have a I have a little tip before I like do all the fancy stuff if it's if I have it planned out I go and sketch it and then like paint over my sketch a little bit. Okay, so this is just like a little three minute sketch. It's not really good. Um, I don't like this very much, so I'm gonna think about it for a little bit and like notice what I did wrong and like look up a picture of what I want to do and like get a little more inspiration. And that's another tip. Look up pictures to get inspiration and you'll, you'll do better. <laughs> well, and then, yeah, mm-hmm. Uh, so, peace. I'll be right back. Okay, so, change of plans. Um, I'm not gonna sketch out the whole thing that I want to do. I'm just gonna sketch out the beginning of it, and that's not really good either, but, like, it's just... A quick little sketch I'm gonna practice painting on this to like get a feel of what I need to do on the canvas because the canvas is like it costs way more than the sketchbook so let's do this thing so that's done I'll finish this tomorrow I'll see you tomorrow and yeah peace out hi i'm back it's the next day and i finished my exams and i'm done with school for this year so that's great and yeah i'm pretty excited now i i'm gonna finish my little practice thing and i'm gonna do that no I'm going to show y'all how I'm doing it. No. I'll show you how. No. I don't know what I'm going to do. Yeah. I'm going to show you. No. I'm indecisive. What should I do? Should I show you how I'm doing the practice thing? Or how I'm doing it on the canvas? On the canvas. The canvas will be my final decision. So I'm going to show y'all how to do that. So I'm going to go practice doing this off camera and 
so I'll see you later. So I'm done practice painting and I'm not going to show you what I did because it's a little terrible and it's a surprise what I'm painting. Probably already said it earlier but like hello. Uh, I decided that I don't like this background color so I'm going to change it and I'm going to do a very light blue to go on the back and hopefully it dries soon or I'm going to be finishing this tomorrow. <laughs> Love that. Um, but I will not be going to school tomorrow so I'll be here and I'll have time to do that. Alright, so I'm going to go paint this light blue off camera and I'll see you later. Won't you stay for a moment so I can say I Hi sisters, so I decided to go all out and I wasn't planning to do this but it's how it turned out and like this is just the base and I have paint all over me. How do people manage to paint and not get it all over them? Because clearly I can't do it. Luckily I don't have any of my sweater because this is like one of my favorite sweaters and I should have probably changed before I started painting but too late now so. I probably just jinxed myself and I'm probably going to get paint all over me and oh well because this is how it be man. It's just, it's just life. How my life be. So these are clouds as you can probably tell. Um, yeah. This is just the base man. So I gotta wait on this to dry of my life and then we're gonna paint a sunflower eye oh, wait I can't tell you I'm gonna blur that out okay goodbye hi it's a week later and I'm finally editing um it's me what do you expect but uh yeah I decided not to blurt it out because I don't know, it's just, I put it in the thumbnail, so, y'all know what it is, but, yeah, I was so fixed on this being a whole big surprise when I was filming, but it's not gonna be a surprise, so, <laughs> oh well. Hi, it's Savannah again, I don't know why I have to introduce myself again, but I'm back, and I made another practice painting drawing thing. And it's better than the first. I started out on my base and I'm sick. If you can't tell, I'm allergic to cats and I have four. <laughs> Love that for me. Let's just work on this real quick and see what we can do tonight. So I drew with pencil the outline of the eye and then I went over with a... Um, brown mixed with a light pink to make a little skin color. Now I'm gonna go use the white make it look more like an eyeball. I need you so cause right now you know there's nothing here. It looks really rough right now but it will get better. Uh, <laughs> eventually hopefully so now I'm gonna go in with a brown and make a little circle in there and I'm obsessed with you well I'm falling asleep editing this this is really boring and I was really tired so if you want to skip the little tutorial thing I did I'll put a little timestamp and you can just put the little red slider bar to that time and we'll be all Gucci. So, 
looks really rough right now. But once we add a few details, it'll look better. Let's dry it just a little bit. Now I'm going to go over with the dark brown and just make this eye darker. The outline color and make a little bit of an eyelid. Not much of one, but a little bit. And I'm going to go over the outline to fix up the white. So that should be good with the outline. It's a little overdone, I'd say, but it's fine. I'll just clean it up a little bit with the white later. And now I'm going to take some orange. It kind of looks red, but I promise it's orange. And I'm going to take a paint knife and around the eye, go over with red. Correction, the color of that paint was supposed to be orange. It said it was orange, but it was very red, so. Red, like, blobs. It really looks red, but, oh well. And I'm just gonna go over the whole eyeball, around the whole eye. Now, we have that off camera. I made a little mixture of colors, deep orange, and medium yellow. So you take the brush and you start at the end and then go up and twist it like that. And then just continue that. So I'm going to do the rest off camera and I'll see you when it's done. Okay, so I'm done with this and I'm big sleepy. So I'm going to let this dry overnight and I'll finish it tomorrow. Hi, so it's the next day. I did another um, layer of yellow on my sunflower petals and it's not looking very good. So I'm going to go in and put in some shadows to make it look more like a flower. <laughs> and I'm going to go in and make a little stem and put a little, put a little leaf on that stem. Okay almost done added a few more details and added a stem and i just need to fix it up a little more and we'll be good okay so it's the next morning i finished it yesterday but i was too tired and i didn't want to record so it is the a.m and i have my retainer in but She's done.